Canada is at today, they, in the past five years, they've almost, almost quintupled their organ donation rate. And we can do it in Canada, and that's what we have to do. So don't, again, from me, uh, many thanks for this opportunity to speak to Ontario's uh, population and tell them our story. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, George. Now, we may have some questions. So, what's the province doing, and what can the province do? One of the things that we think that they should be doing is uh, uh, promoting the development of a federal uh, organ donation registration system. What we have in place now is a bit of a haphazard addendum to license renewals. Uh, you renew your license, there's an opportunity there for you to um, express your wish when it comes to donating organs at the time of death. But many people don't have a license. Many people don't fill out that card. But what uh, John and George have discovered in their uh, many, many contacts with Ontarians is that, you know, Ontarians, their hearts are there already. They want to help. This costs nothing. There's a real opportunity here to make a difference in the life, in the life of somebody else. I think the role of government in this chamber is merely to, fac to facilitate uh, the expression of that care, caring spirit. So there should be a national system in place where, whereby every single Canadian could fill out some kind of form uh, which uh, gives uh, expression uh, to their last wishes when it comes to dealing with their, with their organs. Can I, uh, can I uh, interrupt at this point? <coughs> uh, great question, thank you very much. One of the things that we've learned in the step-by-step -step organization is that unfortunately with the change in the license format in Ontario, the donor card comes as a separate item in the package with your license material. Now we've learned that many times unfortunately for whatever reason, that card is not being inserted in the package. Or the other thing that happens is people get the card, they don't recognize it because it's a change from signing the back of their license, and they throw it away. So a lot of the people that George has talked to as he walked around the province didn't know what a donor card was, didn't have one, had never signed one, but wanted to. And so we found a printer who was willing to donate uh, the printing of, of organ donation cards, and we've had these prepared. And I'd like to ask you, Dalton, at this point, to sign this card indicating your wishes to donate your organs and uh, hopefully to serve as an example to everybody in Ontario to do the same thing. It'd be a pleasure. Thank you, Don. You may have just saved some lives. say, make it possible for me to do this. I think most Ontarians will tell you, you know, I need such a busy life. Uh, I really would like to be able to do something positive. I'm just so busy. But if you tell me you provide an opportunity for me to make a real difference in the life of somebody, make it easy for me to do that, I'll be there for you. It's cost-free. At the end, it does something more important than anything else on the planet. It saves a life. Trying to remember the number of newspapers that carried stories. Virtually every radio station and every community. How many? 35. 35 newspapers. Yeah, right. Um, that carried stories and most of the time front page news. So they've got copies of all of that. So we'll uh, have to follow up. All right, ready? Here we go. Don't blink. Okay, one more here. Okay. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to. I'm just worried about this. Oh, okay. Yes. We're going to go to yeah. the collection. That's great. Okay, and John, you would be shaking sure. Wally's hand there. Okay. That's all. Okay, and I'm going to take one more picture of George. Um, let's see, we've got in the background. Just John, looking over there. there. Looking over there? Yeah. Stay, um, staying there? Yeah, just standing right there, just looking like a Joe. Yeah, looking at Joe. <laughs> <laughs> 
Getting next lippy, week. eh? Yeah, next week. I did the black. Oh my god. I can't even drive that far. <laughs> so show the ladies uh, where you started. Do you want to do well, your, your, put your finger in? Uh, yeah, I, uh, we started on June 26th uh, from Toronto. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, we walked along Highway 2 all the way up to uh, Brockville over here. Uh, and by that time we didn't get eaten alive by uh, the mosquitoes. That later. Yes. <laughs> Uh, as I was going up this way, I was starting to get uh, eaten alive. Uh, and we went up to uh, North Bay, uh, and we went along right up to, uh, well, North Bay's over here, so we, uh, and then we went to Sudbury, and I walked to, uh, uh, that was, uh, we came back to Sudbury, we got on the ferry, started walk, or we got off the ferry, started walking along the uh, 6 and Highway 26, and we went to Owen Sound, Collingwood, uh, uh, around the uh, Georgian Bay here. We touched on Woodbridge. Oh, yeah. Uh, Market Lane, Market yeah, Lane. Market Lane, that's right. That. That's called Central Ontario, yeah. though. That's okay. <laughs> and then I uh, started walking uh, west towards Hamilton. I went right around the Niagara region. Uh, we drove a little bit over here. And I went up to Bradford, uh, Stratford, uh, came down to London. Uh, went to Sarnia, came down to Chatham, uh, went to Windsor, and then we drove back to London and I walked to Kitchener, Walf, uh, Mississauga, and today I'm in Toronto, uh, 22 kilometers, uh, 2278 kilometers. So uh, it's a little bit more than the 2000, but uh, as I'm trying to say to people, I always got to put a little bit extra in the uh, life. Great. You got a frame this, so don't, let's not get well, yeah. it. Yet. Yeah, this is going to be free. Let's go inside. Let's go have a cup of coffee. You know, just almost reinforced my pride uh, of, of being a Canadian. And it just felt almost my duty to perform as a Canadian to do this. Uh, so, um, you know, I just want to state that I'm very proud to be an Italian Canadian. And, uh, uh, with emphasis you. on both. With <laughs> emphasis on both. Yeah, both that's right. Both. Nice mix there. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Wow, man, fuck, we accumulated a lot of shit, eh? Kinda gonna miss this place, how about you? Oh, who knows, you're leaving it. Oh, I might, I might be winter. living in here, eh? Oh, that would be sad, bro. Oh. What do you mean, no, it wouldn't? It means that you start determination. Yeah, okay, it means that I'm broken, I'm poor, and I need welfare. What, there's a positive side of being broken poor? No, that means that if we were here, that means that we were still determined to ultimately with this. With what? I did my time, buddy. 